Me and 12 other Two Cities members went to Rio, Brazil. Um, we partnered with a local church plant that was a newer church plant. Um, our goal was to encourage and work alongside them for the week we were there. Um, we prayer walked in the mornings, went and did evangelism on the streets that we focused on in the area, and really just were training and working alongside the new church plant. We, we spent the whole week really um, just talking to people within four streets um, right around the, uh, the local church. I truly saw this trip as an extension of the capacity of the team on the ground there. We worked four streets for five days and could have worked them easily another week. It really put me out of my comfort zone and I really felt God calling me out of my comfort zone. We're talking to people just about the simplicity of the gospel, just about, you know, all you have to do is, um, you know, believe in Christ and he's already done the work for you. And that next step was helping them connect with the local church because we're, we're leaving. And so we wanna make sure the local church is connected to these people that are in this neighborhood. I felt like he had already orchestrated every door that we knocked on um, and every person that we told the gospel to. I had this aha moment as I'm trying to get my point across to one of the Brazilians that we were speaking to and really wishing that I knew the language. And, and this, this light bulb went off of, Derek, you know the language very well at home and you do not use it the way you wish you could use it here. So I've always known I wanted to go on a missions trip. Um, I've just honestly made excuses in the past, whether it be the funds or the timing wasn't right. Um, but this time I just really felt a calling to go to Brazil. And I just put the yes on the table and just trusted that God would make a way if he wanted me to go. At the end of the day, the Lord will, will use it. He'll bless it. So if you're thinking about going on a mission trip, my encouragement to you is, what are you waiting for? He will provide the things that you need to go. I really encourage you, uh, your life will be changed.